Whoa! Good evening and welcome back to Let's Play Life is Strange. When we left off last time, we were on an airplane. Um, so, just a whirlwind of things. Uh, we were able to, well, we were trapped in the, the dark room with Mr. Jefferson the Creeper, who's been the perpetrator all along. Uh, we were able to dive into one of our earlier selfie photos and alert David Madsen. And I'm actually kind of excited about that, that he ended up kind of, David Madsen is the, the good guy who was able to, to, make things work out. It's uh, his intent. He's, he's kind of over the top about the way he does things. He's very intense, but his intent is in the correct place. He does want to keep people safe. So I'm excited about that. Um, apparently we've won the contest now the everyday heroes cause we're on the plane, right? For that. So it just remains to be seen how everything's going to end up playing out. Are we still good friends with Chloe? What about Kate? Okay. You're okay, Max. You're safe. On a plane. I hope I did everything right this time. Hopefully. It still remains to be seen what's gonna come of the two moons and everything else. Local teacher arrested. Good work, David. Holy shit, you Chloe. rule, Max. I am so proud of my superstar. This is just the start of your career. Oh, you're alive. Okay, good deal. So things I are looking good. It. She's alive, we're still friends. I fixed everything. Well, hopefully everything. Well, we didn't fix Rachel Amber. I'm still... I'm still holding out hope that we're going to find a way to save her, too. All right. Flip that paper again. Anything more? The beginning here? of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Two Moon Diner. Amid all the environmental chaos in Arcadia Bay, oh, so that's still an issue, such as the unseasonal snowfall and beached whales. Some residents reported seeing two full moons last night around 8 p.m. Witnesses claimed the double moons were clear in the, the night sky until clouds covered them up shortly after they appeared. No cell phone or video footage has surfaced yet, which has led local meteorologists to believe that imaginations are in overdrive due to the recent eco havoc. And Blackwell Security uncovers bunker and scandal. Acting on a series of tips from David Madsen, head of security at Blackwell Academy, police officers descended Tuesday on a bizarre underground chamber allegedly used by teacher Mark Jefferson and student Nathan Prescott to drug, kidnap, and photograph young women. Although there were no other signs of physical or sexual assault on the victims, the disturbing revelations have sent shockwaves through the tranquil city of Arcadia Bay. Even Sean Prescott, the most powerful businessman in the area, is under investigation for his role as owner of the farmhouse where the high-tech darkroom studio Studio was located. Good. All right. What else we got in here? Let's see. There's the obvious things in front of us. Anything else? How am I supposed to figure that out? Aw, oh, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch him all the time <laughs> when we were innocent. Hot Dog Man, huh? All right. Excuse me, sir. Do your phone have to be shut off before we descend? I have to admit, I love being called an artist. Everyday heroes. Why? It's not like we're going to crash. These are FCC rules, sir. It's so weird to be in between realities. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited to fasten your seat oh. and stow any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. But what's going to happen? Uh, I don't at home? think so. I'm hoping these airline seats get smaller so I won't have to fly at all anymore. All right, we will talk to you, Principal Wells, but I'm wondering what's going to be happening back in Arcadia Bay. This is the day of the tornado, right? I bet this is a nice break for Principal Wells. Is it still going to happen? After all the damage control he had to do this week at Blackwell. I'd like to make the CEO How did you sleep? 
Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. Just a bit. It's been a tough week at Blackwell. So I hope you'll forgive me. Between Mr. Jefferson and Prescott's, things have been hectic, to say the least. I totally get it, Principal Wells. Yep. That's a smart way of telling me to stop whining. We are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guide you wanted in San Francisco. Well, I don't want but we all Creeper want Teacher, you to have a great so experience this is here. just fine. I already am, and we're not even there. Uh-oh. Oh, Christ. Another nosebleed? Max, you're not just screwing around with time. Okay, where are we at now? Oh, the gallery. So where's our picture? San Francisco is so cool, and this gallery is huge. So is the buffet. If an Ooh. event skimps on the food, you know it's a bad event. As long as I don't have to eat any caviar. This is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. Well, let's do. Work the room. I don't know. I, I feel so weird, like I'm a little kid hanging with the adults. Max. After this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by your peers. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. Hmm. Hell, I wanted to be in charge of a big school someday. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. <laughs> Ask my poor classmates. Max, I'm going to eat up that caviar so you don't have to. Uh, better get in there and start schmoozing. You know, right. I won't always be here to take charge, but you come talk to me whenever you want. Come on, Max. After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. This is a different kind of scary, though. As young as she is, and as important wow, so as Max, this is to her, you it's, did it somehow. It's a really I big went thing from for a dark her. Room to this gallery. I've been through so many realities in one week. Yeah, that would be confusing. Life is weird. But yeah, I can see where this would be really intimidating for her because she wants this to work out so badly. All right, official winners of the Everyday Heroes Contest. There I am, along with all the other winners. Max Caulfield. I should say artists instead. Let's go chat with the receptionist. I never thought I'd get to speak to a gallery receptionist about my own work. Nice. Why, good morning. You must be Max Caulfield. Congratulations for your everyday heroes photo. Why, thank you. The exhibition is quite impressive, especially with your entry. I wish I had time to go see those murals here. I need to drop some serious cash in there. Patrons and donations. Give the gift of art. Donations go straight into community arts programs. Thank you. all Anything back here? Nope. And probably not over here by the bathrooms either, but we're just gonna check to be on the safe side. Okay. Wow, sir. A Danny Lee article. I left my art in San Francisco. 
Yes, I was born on the BART train, literally. It's a long, amazing story that I won't repeat here. Drinks are required for that one. Here's to Mom. That might explain my obsessive love for the Bay Area and its outpost of artists and dissidents. Despite the rampant gentrification, artists and creators thrive regardless of socioeconomic pressures because that's what they do. Galleries such as the Zeitgeist... Zeitgeist? Probably saying that wrong. And... Mikovich and fashion have engaged with a diverse community and practiced what some patrons only what some patrons only preach. I love how much cool art is going on all over the Bay Area. Unlike Arcadia Bay. Learn the craft and history of the Shambhala. Weekly classes with teacher Charles Ellick. Some mysteries should stay that way. Kaltiki Tours presents Mysteries of the Pacific Islands, three-hour tour of the Bay Area coastline. Visit ancient burial and ceremonial sites, discover local lore and legends. Wait. Oh, okay. I'm like, daily from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m.? That's 12 hours. But no, it must mean there's three-hour tours that run within that time frame. I'm hoping. All right, what else we got here? That's that one. That's the leaflet. Holy shit. This flyer was designed just for Chloe. Skull and Bones, Hallow's Eve I'm Party. Ready for the mosh pit. Spooky art, ink portraits, horror bands, midnight burlesque, tricks, something I can't read because it's too shiny, dusted on, 18 and over only. Tricks and treats. Oh, and... Holy, but what would I wear? Nigel Samhain Druid Festival. October 31st, 11 till, you know, whenever, at the Golden Gate Park. What's this down on the ground? All right, well, I suppose we should start by talking to this gentleman. Except we can't. What is a hero? The gallery is proud to be a participant in the 2013 Everyday Heroes National Contest, a showcase for today's future stars of photography. The winners, chosen by prestigious teachers from art schools and programs across the nation, reveal imaginative skill and heartfelt awareness which highlight the casual heroism of those who may never appear on the news or reality shows for unrecognized deeds to the community and beyond. Celebrating each young artist in their work is as important as their celebration of our all-too-invisible everyday heroes. Oh, yeah, let's sign the guest It's book. great to read all these comments. Even the mean ones. So inspiring. Not as good as last year's show. Totally makes me want to start taking photos. The future of photography starts here. These heroes chose the path of least regret. A great example of total surveillance. Their 15 minutes are almost up. Thanks, this is so nice. Inspiring stuff. Ooh. Look at this print. The depth of field, the colors. Look at the bulk of shape. This was definitely shot. We're gonna start down in this room. Well, we got a lot of empty space on the wall here, guys. Could have fit some more pictures. Sure, we'll take a picture of her camera. Oh, we actually took her camera. That's kind of weird. Hmm. That looks familiar. This might be too meta-metaphoric. Okay. Comforting child. Please. Can't really interact with those. Let's talk to whoever Aren't this is. are you from Blackwell Academy? I wanted to go there, but I didn't get in. They have such a cool program. I bet you're learning a lot. She recognizes me? Well. That one is kind of silly. Yeah, a bit. I would love to have this on a shelf. Someday. I like. Oh, but... Imagine how much time it takes to make one sculpture. Does it take a lot of time to make a sculpture like that? It doesn't... I don't know. I've never made a sculpture. It doesn't seem like they would be that difficult, but I could be totally wrong. What have we got over here? Oh. Well, it turns out this uh, downstairs area was much less exciting than I thought it would be. over here. The hot dog. Can I talk to any of you? Come on, Max, you got a schmooze. Oh. Well, 
Black, I do not understand art. Oh, we can't talk to her either. But we can talk to this random man. Okay. Well, I have to say, this is the best everyday hero show I've seen <laughs> since it began. All the pictures say a lot about our times. Bravo. We'll give him the benefit of the doubt and assume it's not that he's just saying, whoa, look at two chicks kissing. Maybe he's feeling like, hooray for progress, that they're free to potentially be girlfriends or have a relationship or whatever else and not feel that they have to hide it. He might not be a creepy guy. I guess guy, everybody just... is a photographer now. What? You don't like what you see? That is different. Loving the retro vibe. Me too. Makes me want to go buy an instant camera. Your thoughts, woman? Um, excuse me. I, I just wanted to tell you how much I loved your photograph. Well, thank you. I've seen a lot today, but there's something powerful and understated in yours. I can't wait to see much more of your work in the future. Well, that was really nice. And now that I'm thinking, obviously, duh, that's why the, the girl downstairs knew him from Blackwell, because my portrait is a selfie, so. All right. Let's talk to this journalist. Hi, excuse me, you're Max Caulfield, right? Um, yep. yeah. Yes. Sorry to bother you, but my name is Danny Lee, and I'm with the Berkeley People's Herald. I edit their art section, and I totally dig your work. Now, I know the whole ironic selfie thing is kind of played out, but there's something timeless about your images. So I I'd love to set up an appointment or, or interview with you when you get a chance. Uh, here's my card. Ooh, well, So great talking with you, Max. You too, Danny. Although the tough thing about this in the aftermath of Jefferson is that now there's kind of a distrust with anyone who like okay i'm sure this guy is just a journalist and really just wants to do some type of interview with her and that's all it is but kind of weary I of everyone at this point i get so inspired whenever i come here hey i love your shot thank I you i just wanted to say congratulations and i hope you get a lot more attention this makes me feel so sad. Like I, usually these kind of contests, they, they put me to sleep, but I like how this show is about specific actions, you know, not just abstractions. The zeitgeist is doing some unique stuff this year. Oh, zeitgeist, there we go. Bad exposure, bad framing, bad picture. Wow. I could have done this so much better. Well, then why didn't you? I can't believe I'm in San Francisco. How can I process this after all the death I've seen this week? I wish Chloe was here with me now. Without her, I couldn't have fought Jefferson. And she always pushed me to not be shy about my photos. Even if that feels so trivial after what happened with Rachel. And Kate. Well, except the thing with Kate didn't happen now. For Reality whatever changed. reason, I have this power. I hope I finally used it right. It would be nice if Chloe were here with us. Kind of missing her. I mean, this is the last chapter, but we're kind of towards the beginning-ish of it, so I'm thinking there should still be a fair amount to go. I'm sure we're going to have to meet up with her again. Definitely want to see her again. And it feels like things aren't all wrapped up yet. We don't know what's going on exactly with the reality. We don't know what's going on with the weather, the tornado. It's got to all tie back into the lighthouse, right? So... All right, what well, we got over here? God, I love art. You must be the everyday hero from Blackwell. My name is Lauren Francis, and I run the media department at Detroit School of Visual Arts. I'd love to talk about you being a residency next spring. Don't say anything to Principal Wells yet. Detroit, huh? Head over to my neck of the woods, Max. Coming to Michigan? 
That's a big move, Oregon and Michigan. I wonder if I can buy these everyday heroes pictures. Sorry, I don't know your name, but I saw your picture in the gallery brochure, and uh, I just wanted to let you know how cool your entry was. Well, thank you. How do these galleries afford to rent here? Oh. Okay, we don't want to talk to Principal Wells yet. I don't think we could talk to. Oh, but I heard talk Mark to Jefferson guy. was supposed to be here tonight. Not anymore. That was so shocking. I have one of his monographs too. Hold on to it. His work is going to be worth serious cash. Ooh, it is, and that's so gross. Are you Max Caulfield? Bravo on your entry. I'm the art critic for Iris N Magazine, and we would love to include you in a piece about future trendsetters in photography. Well, well. I'll send you the details this week, if that's okay. Absolutely. Congratulations for your piece. He's right, though, that point about Not my style, Mark Jefferson's but art. The neon is a nice representation. Oh, shit. Pretentious alert. People have a fascination with the gruesome. Ooh, what do we got here? I guess I have to get used to the idea of fancy food I don't want to eat. You don't want to eat it? Max, you gotta. I love trying new things. You gotta sample all of that stuff. Come on. I know it's kind of simple, but I find this haunting. Right? The instant print makes it look timeless. Nostalgic melancholy. A Who's teenage girl. Who's the artist? I think it's for some contest. That's cool. See oh, hey, you're the one who entered the self-portrait. Yep. Or actually, do you call it a selfie? Anyway, I was very impressed about how you subverted it to make all of your photo subjects the focus. Oh, uh, very smart. Thank you. Young and grunge. He'll think about those days for the rest of his life in prison. Good. That's Mark Jefferson, noted photographer and teacher arrested for homicide and kidnapping. Yeah, that is a very strange picture of him compared to how we've always seen him. Hmm, a bit of champagne, eh? Champagne makes me think of me and Chloe getting busted with that wine. All right. Like, I do not understand. Oh. I guess everybody is a photographer now. Let's check out our picture, and then we'll go talk to Principal Wells. We can't talk to any of the people lumped around looking at it? All right. Hi, and there she is to save the day. Hi. You did it, Max. You're a real artist. At least for today. Uh-oh. <gasps> Is that happening back home? Are we gonna have to leave all of this behind to jump into a, a picture? Hey, are you okay? We lost uh, you there for a second. I'm okay. Uh, jet lag. High altitude. Was this oh, just a taste? The off, idiot. To show us our dream come true, but we're gonna come have to on. sacrifice it to save Chloe. Please answer. Max, holy shit, man, your vision. It's it's true. You, you saw the tornado, it's coming. What? Oh no. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared. I'm I'm by the beach. I'm Chloe! Can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Oh my god, the tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is going to be destroyed. So we fixed a problem, there but has not the to key be a problem. Way to stop this. For good. Save Rachel Amber. We got to find a way to do it. Okay, let's go back to our pictures. I was going to talk to Principal Wells next, but no, I think we have to go back to our picture 
because it's a picture of a ton of pictures. And we gotta find one to jump into, is my guess. No fucking way. Chloe can't die again. I have to save her. I guess everybody is a photographer now. All right, yep. Okay, well, since we're gonna go in there, let's talk to Principal Rouse real exposure. quick, just to see what he has to say. Bad this makes me feel How do these galleries afford to rent here? The way he'd said it, come talk to me when you're ready for whatever, I thought, oh, I can't even talk to him now. Dang. Thought I was gonna, um, progress us to the next event, but nope, this is what we gotta do. You gotta jump way far back, Max. You gotta save Rachel. Okay. Excuse me, I'd love to ask you a few questions about your work. I'm uh, kind of busy right now. Okay, there we go, there we go. Don't anyone else interrupt. Just let me do my thing. Yeah, this isn't good. What is going on now? It feels like reality is breaking apart. What am I doing to time? Hmm. Well. Okay, so what... My previous timeline was so perfect. I'll accept that I need to be in Arcadia Bay, not San Francisco. Okay, so we, yeah, we can't even get over here. Very restricted bounds. It's looking like this is the only thing we can do. I just have to make one simple change, so I won't end up in San Francisco. Simple. I'll destroy the photo. Okay. Sorry, San Francisco. Chloe comes first. Oh, yep, so she's gonna sacrifice that piece of her dream. Although, it's still, there's a lot of hope, you know. I mean, just because she's not winning this, this contest would have been a great thing for her to win, but just because she's not doesn't mean she's not gonna be able to eventually be a famous photographer someday if she wants. Wait. But he's not caught now? Really? Oh, fuck. Ugh. God, no. I'm back here again? I thought I fixed everything. What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, answer my question, please. <laughs> I enjoy both of these conversation options. Um, Eat shit and die. Good answer. Good answer. Hey, your nose is bleeding. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. That's nothing to do with you. But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world problem. Oh, I had to let Victoria Chase go. What? You let her? Don't be stupid, okay? She's exactly where she deserves to be. What do you mean? No. <gasps> oh, as if you care. Uh, I do, actually. It doesn't matter that we weren't friends. I don't want him killing people. Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Sorry. I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Uh -oh. Fuck. He burned my diary. Always 
That's why I'm still here. Okay. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something weird going on with you. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Did you see how crazy it is outside? The tornado. Like I said, something weird. There's that fear. Oh, Max, it's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. Now, okay, so we can rewind time on our own without a picture. And we found we can jump back into the pictures. Now, that comment he just made a little bit ago about the pictures you're taking of me now in your head. Maybe, Max, maybe if we focus really hard on a memory, we could jump the into loss that. Of youth. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. Ugh. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. All right, what are we going to do? Please, don't do this. All right, look around. Your foot's free. What else can we manage? I promise, this final dose won't hurt. No. There's gotta be... something else to do. <laughs> okay. All the way to here? I promise. No, there's This gotta... final dose won't hurt. I don't see anything I can... What? Ooh. Okay. I just needed to be a little bit patient. Who's who's down here? Call out, Max. Warn him. Oh, and why didn't we? Okay. No. So what we need to do is scream really loud. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Wait, hold on. Can I? Can I please ask you for one last request? Oh, you got me, Max. How can I deny that face? Um... Yeah, I think a picture is likely to sway him. Would you... Uh, take... one last picture of me? I... I want to be your best subject. I almost don't believe that, but... I think you've finally learned from me. This also will keep him nice and focused, so that David can creep up behind him. Hopefully. Okay. Uh, David Madsen? I promise. This final dose won't hurt. What? Okay, shout, Max. Warn. Yeah. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Okay. Get the camera next to you! Alright. What else can we do to no help gun. him? No gun. No balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. <gasps> ah, crap. Alright. Back we go. Over. You are not going to stop me. Ugh. Further. First thing we want to do is warn about the gun Jefferson, over here. Jefferson, it's over. He's hiding a gun over there. Okay, that didn't Sorry, do it. Sorry, Madsen. All right, then. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me.
Okay. Ooh, all right. Oh, Lord, Max. Are you okay? Not especially. Are you all right? Can you move? Yes. Thank you, David. Thank you. But what about oh, Chloe? Me. You brought me here. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. Okay. He won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson, now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Warren, yes, I, I can use that picture he took of us. Shit, no signal. Okay, well, let's finish up in here and step outside. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson, signal. but you won't need this anymore. Ooh, all right. Okay, and I'm gonna go ahead and to know about this. wind the episode down here. Please like and subscribe and if you've Warren. enjoyed this. Oh, please answer. Come back next time. We'll go outside and call Warren.